Hello and welcome to Daybreak English. Today is a vocabulary lesson. We're going to look at the word really, its different meanings and how to use it in a conversation. Hi, I'm Dawn. How are you today? The first meaning of really is similar to very. We use it as an intensifier with adjectives and other adverbs. For example, my interview today is really important. Here it intensifies the adjective important, which is describing the noun interview. For example, there was not much traffic today, so we got here really quickly. In this case, it intensifies the adverb quickly. We didn't just get here quickly, we got here extremely quickly. And also as an adverb to modify verbs. For example, I don't really want to go home now, but I need to get up early tomorrow. Here really is used to modify the stative verb want. I really love traveling to new places. But be aware, although really and very are similar words, they aren't exactly the same. And you can't use very to modify a verb. Take our previous example. You can't say, I very love traveling to new places. That's incorrect. Also, very can be used to modify a noun, whereas really cannot. For example, you can say, I went to the very top of the mountain, which means the highest part of the mountain. But you can't say, I went to the really top of the mountain. It just doesn't work. Really can also be used as an adverb in a similar way to in fact, actually, or indeed. You can use it to comment on a whole sentence or a clause. For example, you fell asleep during the concert, but I thought it was quite good, really. With the same meaning, we can use really as an exclamation to clarify what someone has said. For example, George proposed to me last night. Oh, really? Congratulations! Similarly, we can use really to question whether what someone has said is actually true. Hmm, so tell me what really happened. So you've told me something and I don't believe it. <laughs> If you want to say no to something, but want to be a little more polite, you can use not really. Did you enjoy the movie? Not really. Do you think I should buy this dress? Oh, not really. Finally, we can use really in the same way as we would use the word seriously in questions and exclamations where you expect the answer should be negative. In this case, your tone of voice is extremely important. You need to convey that you doubt this through your voice. For example, do we really think that politician is telling the truth? In other words, in fact, the answer is no, we don't think he's telling the truth. And in an exclamation, someone says to you, I think that politician is trustworthy. You say, really? Okay, so that's it from me for today. I hope this has helped you somewhat. I'd like you to practice using really in sentences, in each of these different ways.
perhaps you could write your sentence in the comments below. I would love to see what you come up with. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like. Remember to subscribe and click on the notification bell. Why not check out this video? See you again soon. Bye.